right, Bob is here, and we got her fixed. The fuse box, Bob, Joe's going to explain it to Bob. He's a little bit tired, straighten out the wires, and it's good to go. Fuse box is definitely going to be something in the future Bob's going to want to deal with, but we were able to get it working for him on his road trip back. Remember, it's an old car, guys. So here she is. I'm going to turn it around, the last view of her, before she heads out to Michigan. And she's looking quite beautiful. I'm proud. And here she is in all of her glory. Bob, I know you haven't driven her yet, but are you are you still happy? I'm not going to talk about it yet. You're not going to talk about it yet? No. You, are you going to wait? I'm going to wait till I get home. Uh, uh, <laughs> that way, that way, I don't have to tell a lie. All right, hey, and I don't want you to lie. I want you to tell me when you're happy. And there she is. <laughs> Heading out in all of her glory, her beautiful engine compartment. And uh, I'm quite proud of this project. It's been an adventure, and it's hard to believe that this was dark green, unrestored when I first started out. I had this the first six months of our business, and uh, she's about to head out. Bobby's painting and he's in the details. He's in the details. Bobby's hands on for this car. It's a rarity. Tilt-away wheel, all new vinyl, doors, it's in the detail. It's in the detail. And is this 69 heads away? Get ready for a super focus on a 1970 Mach 1 and a 1967 GT350 and a 1971 429 Cobra Jet and many, 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 many other cars that are getting a lot of love over here at Mustang Medic. It's a good name. 